Hoffman rearrangement reaction, also known as Hoffman degradation reaction. So, what is Hoffman rearrangement? The conversion of primary amine, primary amide to primary amine. So, one carbon atom will be less in product. So, in reactant RCONH2, RCONH2 is what? Primary amide. And the product is RNH2. RNH2 that is primary amine. So, primary amide is converted to primary amine with one carbon atom less and an intermediate is formed in the reaction. So, through an intermediate. So, that intermediate, intermediate is called Rn double bond C double bond O that is called isocyanate. So, cyanide is Cn and isocyanate is Nc. So, Rn double bond C double bond O that is isocyanate intermediate here. And what are the reagents? Reagent is hypohalite. Hypohalite. Hypohalite means oxyanion with the halogen. Oxyanion. Oxyanion with the halogen. For example, ClO minus a halogen chloride and oxyanion. So ClO minus is the oxyanion with the halogen that is hypohalite. So this Hoffman rearrangement is through a conversion is the conversion of primary amide with a hypohalite giving primary amine. Now let's discuss the mechanism behind Hoffman rearrangement. So first we are taking what primary amide. So R C O C double bond O N H two that is primary amide. Now in the reaction media, what are the reagents Br2 and KOH or NaOH? Br2 and KOH. So there is OH minus. So OH minus will attack the hydrogen, one of the hydrogen of NH2. So this can be written as like this, H. So this will eliminate as H plus and combine with OH minus forming water. And what happened? This electron is shifted to here and here a double bond will make. So R C O minus double bond NH. Now this Br2 will attack the nitrogen. So Br2, Br single bond Br and this bond is eliminated. This Br is eliminated and this bromine will attack the nitrogen. So R, this bond will come to here, R, C double bond O, N, H, B, R. R, C double bond O, N, H, B, R. Now again this hydrogen can be eliminated as H plus and combined with OH minus forming water. So this will eliminate as H plus and combined with OH minus forming water. So the rest product will be, the remaining structure is, R C O minus this will shift to here and here a double bond will come double bond N B R R C O minus double bond N B R now the rearrangement happened the rearrangement of R group alkyl group to form what isocyanate so R will shift to here nitrogen the bromine will amine so the remaining structure isocyanate is R in double bond C double bond this will shift to here double bond O so R in C double bond O isocyanate is formed in the first section I have given isocyanate converted to primary amine how the isocyanate is hydrolyzed H2O is added so this isocyanate is hydrolyzed I will write here R in Double bond C, double bond O is hydrolyzed. So OH minus and H plus are given. So OH minus will attack the carbon and H plus will attack nitrogen. So we will get R, NH, COH and double bond O. R, NH, COH, double bond O. Again adding water that is H plus and OH minus. Now this hydrogen, this hydrogen of OH 
will combine with OH minus and form water and this H plus, this H plus will be added to RNH, this nitrogen. So what will be the product? RNH2, RNH2 and COO, COO, that is CO2. So RNH2 plus CO2. So the primary amine is formed via the intermediate called isocyanate. RN, RN, double bond C, double bond O is the isocyanate. So primary amine is formed. So this is the mechanism for Hoffman rearrangement reaction. Now moving on to examples. First one, the benzene ring attached to NO2 and double bond O NH2 a amount. Primary amount. So, in this primary amide, we are adding NBS, DBU and MEOH. So, you have to look at this MEOH and NBS. So, bromine is there. So, first we will add this NBS. So, what will we get? The benzene ring and the NO2 and here amide. So, when you add the bromine and water, the primary amide is converted to isocyanate first. So, isocyanate formula is RN, RN, double bond C, double bond O. So, this primary amide is converted to isocyanate. So, if you know the mechanism, it's very simple. So, N double bond C, N double bond C, double bond O, that is isocyanate. So, when you add NBS to this, and now, Instead of adding water, we are adding MeOH. So MeOH means OME, OME minus and H plus. So OME minus, OME minus will be attached to carbon. So OME minus is attacking carbon and this H plus is attacking nitrogen. Okay, so the product will be so I will write here, the product is a primary amine, NO2 and NH2. Okay, so NO2 and NH2, a primary amine is formed and the remaining product will be MeOH, MeOH and carbon dioxide, CO2. So OME, OME is added to carbon and H plus is added to nitrogen. So NH2 will be formed. How NH2 is formed? This will form NH and again hydrosis is taking place. H2O is added. H plus and OH minus is added. So this H plus will again added to NH. So NH2 and this OH minus will be added to what? OME. So MeOH and CO2 is formed. In second example, a cyclohexane ring Amine and OH substituent is there. OH substituent is below plane and the migratory group is above plane. So in Hoffman rearrangement, the stereochemistry of migratory group is always retained. So this will be above the plane in product also. And the primary amine is converted to what? Primary amine. And the reagent given is bis trifluoroacetoxy iodobenzene. So, it is used instead of Br2. So, we can replace Br2 with NBS, lead tetraacetate and this compound also, the iodobenzene, trifluoroacetoxy iodobenzene and the other reagents of CH3CN and water. So, what happens? The primary amine is converted to primary amine. So, first isocyanate is formed. Isocyanate. Below plane, isocyanate formula is N double bond C double bond O and a below plane OH is there. So isocyanate is formed first. Here a OH is present and this OH is nearer to the carbon. So what happened? This oxygen will combine with the carbon and form a bond and this will emit as H plus and this H plus will come to nitrogen. H plus. So the product will be uh, amine that is amine below plane that is NH 
then single bond C, double bond O, and here below plane O, C, O, C, double bond O, and match. In third example, the compound containing O, A, C, and below plane as substituent and double bond O, N, H, amide and a double bond O. So, double bond O, C, O, N, H, C, O. And the reagents are Br2 and MeOH. So, when you add Br2, what happened? It is, this amide is converted to isocyanate. And the product will contain a primary amine with one carbon atom less. So, the product will be, the structure is same. So, in the reactant, the number of carbon atom was 5, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So, the product will be 1 carbon atom less. So, NH, NH and 1, 2, 3, 4. C, double bond O. So, the product is NH, C, double bond O. And any OH is there. So, OAC can be hydrolyzed to OH. OH. So the product is NHC double bond O, one carbon atom plus four carbon atom and OH. OAC is converted to OH.